Large symphonic chord voicings can be played easily on the stack. Each white note is an individual note. All of the white keys are mapped to harmonically correct notes within each chord. This is like harmonic quantizing. Harmonic quantizing played live lets you focus on your rhythm and timing, on your chord progressions and being more musically spontaneous. Changing key signatures spontaneously on the fly is easy on the stack and starts a musical adventure. Key of F sharp, G sharp, and back down to key of C. Changing genre on the fly is switching to complex chord voicings like jazz and pop. Here we switch between fifths and the inverted ninths and elevenths of jazz fat with interesting results on the C chord. Now the F chord with the same pattern and back down to C. A key change with the same pattern in the key of D sharp. A cool key change to key of F changes the whole feel. Changing up the chord voicing pattern slightly to make it more interesting. And bring it back down to the original key, descending to C to close the adventure. The stack only listens to the white keys. There are no black keys played on the stack. And that's the magic. That's the harmonic quantizing. Black keys are voiced in the chords, however. Watch the red notes on the keyboard above as we switch key signatures and black keys as well as white keys are voiced. Depending on the key, depending on the chord voicing like fifths, sevenths, and ninths, etc. When it is desirable to play a melody scale, the stack can be instantly switched to a normal piano keyboard mode by pressing the top keyboard's rightmost key. Any one of the four keyboards then plays normally until the right key on the second keyboard is pressed to change it back. Key of F, seventh chord to the fifth to the first.